We've been talking about this game all summer. We've been talking about Utah hosting TCU undefeated, both ranked in the top five. What a big game here on CBS College Sports Network. BJ, here's the way I feel about it. I love TCU. I like Andy Dalton. He's completing 65% of his passes. I think he's one of the most underrated quarterbacks in all of the country. Yeah. Their defense leads the nation only 217 yards a game. They've only scored 78 points against TCU this season. Only 16 points in the last five yeah. games. I, li I like the Horn Frogs in this game. Well, Utah has had this game circled, and you know what happens sometimes when you have a game circled. Just ask Nebraska. They had Texas right. circled from last year's Big 12 championship. I like TCU in the ball game, but I'm going to give Utah a lot of credit with Eddie Wide and Matt Asiato at the running back position. They're t turning it up there, but you're right. Ed Wesley and TCU averaging about 270 yards on the ground. That's going to be a, a difficult contest for, I think, Utah's defense. They're playing well now. Everyone say, well, they barely beat Air Force, TCU. You, they pretty much rally. Yeah, but Air, Air Force, Force is tough. Now. They're a Air tough Force football tough. team. And it helps when they fumble five times, which uh, <laughs> Air Force did in that ball game. But you know what happens when you got college kids and you're out there and you're fired up? Anything can happen. The last time TCU lost in the regular season was two years ago in Salt Lake City. Well, all I know is if Utah wins this game, it's going to get real yeah, interesting, interesting in the BCS standings. All right, we'll see.